So guys, let's get started on how to get the mail landing screen turn. So first thing you need to do, if you're on Windows, duplicate your image by pressing Ctrl J. So after doing that, go to adjustment layer and choose black and white. So for that, you can see uh, we already have the black and white. So here you can change the blending mode to multiply. So you can see the changes. Yeah, if I turn it up, you can see you can see the difference now. So also you can bring the opacity down a bit. Yeah, something like that will be good. So next, go back to adjustment and choose black and white again for the second time. So blending mode, choose multiply, and also you can bring the opacity down way below the first one you did yeah let's say uh something like yeah 31 yeah 31 is fine so next you still need to go back to adjustment layer and click on this time you click on color balance so here you can play with your cyan yeah uh, about five is fine also go to shadows i can also reduce that to something like two three or four Let, let's say four yeah you can see the difference now from what we've done yeah from where we started from so next go back to adjustment layer uh this time again choose black and white and still say multiply so now what you can do here you can play with the red and yellow slider because you can see it's way darker now yeah so you can yeah you can bring it yeah just adjust it the way oh uh, yeah the way you like yeah to make sure it brings something good for you so once you're done with that um go to opacity and also bring the opacity down down can bring the opacity to like oh uh, let me just type 40 percent here yeah yeah to 40 um yeah all we are almost done with it so next oh uh, it's a bit dark so you need to go back to oh uh, to adjustment layer brightness and contrast so uh you can also do this on using camera raw but uh i prefer to do it from here because it's a bit uh, straightforward here so I'll just use that yeah yeah that is fine so now let's see what we've done uh, let me just group all these together yeah by present control G so this is where we started from and here so you can see can you see the difference yeah you can see it so this is where we're going to stop the tutorial today yeah thanks for watching also remember to subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video also i'll, I'll be making this an action uh, preset for this so i don't know where i will upload it now but I'll, i will update you guys to know i'll give it free so you can download the action you can use it on your project so thank you and bye for now